What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. My name's Knights and in today's video I want to go over what I believe is the greatest POI we have ever had in the history of Fortnite. As you guys can see from the title and the thumbnail, it's Grotto 2.0 or Covert Cavern. I think it's a weird name so I just call it Grotto 2.0. It is literally one of the most stacked POIs we have ever had. Now people really have, you know, nostalgic feelings with Tilted, with Stark Season, with Stark uh, POI. And, you know, with all these other lazy links, back in the day was my favorite POI. I loved that. Paradise Palms. People have all their favorites from back in the day. But I don't think it actually comes down to being as stacked as Grotto 2.0, Covert Cavern. This is a ridiculously stacked POI. You've seen the videos about it, people talking about it. I'm going to go over it, talking about my reasoning, why I believe this is just by far the most broken POI in the entire map, in the entire history of Fortnite, guys. So starting straight off, it is ranked number 8 in the terms of chests. I'm going to show this little bit, uh, picture right here, guys, for you. It is ranked number 8 on the map with the POIs when it comes to chest amount with 40 chests. Now, you may think, number 8, that's not that great, right? You know, Tilted is number 1, as you can see right here, the comparison between Tilted and the Grotto. But, you know, that's not all that's important. We got 18 henchman chests, which is by far number 1 and not even close anywhere else. We got 0 in Tilted. Then we have a 104 ammo boxes. The second place one tilted has 56. That is a huge difference. Okay. Then we have 227 floor spawns. So that has more chance to get launch pad. More chance for better loot. More chance to get something off the ground, off the rip to actually get into the fight with. The second place is 198. So not even clear in the 200 mark. Then we have, of course, we have no veggie things, which is unveiled. Un uh, it's it's an it's something that happens. Then we have the barrels, which 34 puts you in the number one situation once again, guys. So this POI is completely broken, and we're not even done yet. We have the OP vault, which honestly the boss isn't really that broken. You know, by yourself maybe it's a little difficult, but with some teammates it's really not that difficult to kill this boss. The vault did get nerfed for the newest update, so, but it, instead of having, you know, four supply drops in there, it only has two, but it also gives you more barrels in there now. So there's even more barrels in the 34 in total. I think now it's going to be like 40 barrels in total throughout the entire POI. Then you have the two things which are rotation. You have the two um, air vent things, which if you don't know, will get you, get you far enough to get you to the rifts. If you need to travel even further away, down that, down south or something like that. Super broken right there. And you have the IO cars, the black cars. Sometimes they spawn with the wheels on them. Sometimes they don't. Either way, they are absolutely one of the most broken vehicles as we've known throughout the last chapter. These are some of the greatest vehicles we can use for rotate pretty much. So overall, this is actually one of the most broken POIs. And the number one thing that people don't mention about this POI, guaranteed max metal. One of the hardest materials to find throughout the entire map. And this area gives it to you in just tons just thousands there's so much metal here guys you could farm up app a whole squad's worth of max metal and probably squads you could probably get 4,000 metal throughout this entire POI alone which I don't think there's any other POI that comes even close tilted I think it's a little like kind of scuffed when it comes to its metal you have some spots some here some there but it's not like an overabundance like Grotto so let me know what you guys think. Do you guys think Grotto right now, Grotto 2.0, Covert Cavern, whatever you want to call it, do you guys think this is the most broken POI we have ever had in the history of Fortnite? For me, it is by far the broken. I land here every single time in solos, scrims. If I'm just trying to have a good time, I land here because this is so broken. Another little side note too is very, very close to it with one air vent little going there, one little car ride. Super close is the guaranteed Larry the Llama. That's what I care. I'll call him. I don't really see other people calling him Larry the Llama. He spawns right there every single time. With the only people you're gonna have a little bit of trouble with is the crack shot cabin team that wants to like run over there and get it. But if honestly, if you get a couple guns real quick, hit the air vent, get over there, you're gonna be the first people there. Better loot and better situation, guys. This is the most broken POI. Camp Cuddle is really close to it. It's one of the most unloved POIs. So you have a backup spot right there. There is so much material in terms of wood and brick on the outside of Grotto. Of course, you get metal. You have launch pad spawns around the entire thing. You have a guaranteed survivable spot. If you guys don't know, if you go into the air vents, go all the way to the bottom, and then underneath the platform thing, you actually will put yourself in an invincibility spot. 
making it one of the most broken spots, guys. So let me know what you guys think. There's so much going for this grotto area. They had actually had to nerf it because it was so broken before the amount of supply drops they had in it. So you get guaranteed two launch pads, guys, from this POI. Guaranteed max metal, guaranteed good loot all throughout. If you get this unconned, it's pretty much like, why aren't you winning the game if you don't win? So let me know what you guys think in the comments below about this POI. If you guys don't think this is the most broken POI of all time, comment below. And actually, comment below what's your guys' favorite POI. For me, I loved Lazy Links back in the day, Chapter 1 days. That was my favorite. So right now, Grotto is really getting close to being my favorite, though. So let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. I do competitive, creative. I do so much of these like talks and tips content. So let me enjoy, let me know if you guys enjoy that kind of stuff in the comments. Subscribe to the channel on the way to 2,000 subscribers. Smash the thumbs up if you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys in the next one. My name is Knights. Peace out.